A recently discovered set of original Nikola Tesla drawings reveal a map to multiplication that contains all numbers in a simple-to-use system. The drawings were discovered at an antique shop in central Phoenix, Arizona by local artist, Abe Zucca. They are believed to have been created during the last years of Tesla's free energy lab, Wardenclyffe. The manuscript is thought to contain many solutions to unanswered questions about mathematics. The sketches were hidden in a small trunk with numerous other drawings and manuscripts ranging from handheld technological devices to free energy systems, many with notes scrawled all over them. Some of the pieces are already familiar to the public, but a few others are not. Most notably is the map to multiplication or the math spiral. Zucca made a few copies and showed the drawings around to different thinkers, dreamers, and mathematicians. A few days later a local high school mathematics instructor, Joey Grether, had been working on deciphering the system and had a few breakthroughs. Grether suggests that the spiral not only explores multiplication as an interwoven web, but that it offers a comprehensive visual understanding of how all numbers are self-organized into 12 positions of composability. This device allows us to see numbers as patterns, the formation of prime numbers, twin primes, highly composite numbers, multiplication and division, as well as few other systems, I imagine, that are yet to be discovered. The diagram itself is very intuitive, allowing students to see how numbers all work together based on a spiral with 12 positions. 12, or 12x, multiples of 12, is the most highly composite system, which is why we have 12 months in a year, 12 inches in a foot, 24 hours in a day etc. 12 can be divided by 2, 3, 4, and 6. So can all multiples of 12. For every 12 numbers there is a chance of 4 numbers being prime. They happen to fall in positions, think clock positions, 5, 7, 11, and 1. Tesla is known for the quote if you only knew the magnificence of the 3, 6 and 9, then you would have the key to the universe. It turns out that when the device is examined, the digital roots of the numbers in positions 3, 6, 9, and 12 constantly repeat the same sequence 3, 6, 9. Is this what Tesla was referring to? The self-organization of numbers and their digital roots? It's hard to say, but Grether seems to think so. This breakthrough is phenomenal. If we could get students all over the globe to use this technique, to play with it, and help figure out how to use it, we could overcome our cultural aversion to mathematics. Instead of memorizing the multiplication table, we could learn the positions of numbers and have a better understanding of how they work. One Zapata, one of Mr. G's students believes so as well. I used to say I'm bad at math. Cause that's what everyone says, but now, I'm like, dude, this is too easy. There's one other fact about the Tesla spiral that make it interesting. The diagram is dated December 12, 2012. 1912. Grether and his students want to turn December 12 into a national holiday. So grab a 12-pack, get a dozen donuts, and celebrate the power of 